you know what happens when you turn on the light in a room? Basically, there is an electricity power plant somewhere that will modify its production. At all times, there is a delicate balance between the electricity supplied to the power grid by the producer and the electricity consumed by the user. When you turn the light on, a plant will increase its production. When you turn it off, it will decrease it. Of course, you alone you do not really create a noticeable change in this balance between electricity consumed and electricity generated. But let's imagine that the weather forecast had predicted strong winds. But in reality, there is little to no wind. The power system engineers are in front of a problem. How to compensate for the lack of wind electricity? One solution is to rely on what we call flexible power plants. A flexible power plant uses gas to generate electricity and is able to very rapidly modify its production to balance the grid. And you can imagine that as we increase the number of wind turbines in the system, the need for those flexible power plants to stabilize the grid will also increase. Unfortunately, these power plants are not profitable anymore. The issue is clear. We need flexible power plants to keep up with the surge in renewable electricity generation, but they are shutting down. How can we make them profitable again? Our proposal is to improve the pricing of electricity. We want the new price of electricity to better value flexibility. If we are on the 10th of August and the sun is shining and the wind is blowing, there is no problem of flexibility. Most of the flexible capacity will be on standby. The value of flexibility will be very small. But if we are on the 20th of December at 8 p.m. and on top of that there is no wind, then the discussion might be a tad more complicated. In this situation, most of the flexible power plant will already be running to compensate for the lack of renewable electricity generation. They will not be able to increase the production if needs be. For us, the price of electricity on the 20th of December should reflect the risk of scarcity and be higher than on the 10th of August. Ma to achieve this goal of a better pricing, I have developed a computer program that allows me to replicate the electricity markets. I simulate the behavior of the market agent to ultimately determine the value of flexibility. These simulations allow us to see what makes flexible power plants profitable again. My name is Jacques, and my goal is to build a price that keeps turning the light on.